Hello, hi everyone. Welcome to Cyprus's Technologies. In today's video, we're going to discuss about the units of measurement and packaging of Udo 90. So let's dive into the sales module first. And from here, we need to move on to the configuration settings in order to enable the units of measurement. So once you enable the units of measurement, you can find the units of measurement under the configuration menu. Here you can see that we have already enabled the feature, which is units of measurement and packagings. The sales and purchase product in different units of measurements uh, or packages. So once it's been set, you can see the feature over here. See, we can just move on to units and packing. So once it's done, you can see that I have created a unit link called piece. So we know one piece means um, it will have one quantity in it. So let me just choose it. So once it's used here, you can see that. And let me create the other one. Uh, the other one is box and a box will have uh, 10 pieces and uh, if you want to specify the quantity over here you can just do so let me say that this uh, box has 10 pieces uh, to easily identify now if you want to set a box of 20 pieces you can also just do so and if you want to set a carton uh, that contains uh, 100 pieces also you can just do that so let me create the other one so let's say uh ctn that is the carton and it has got 100 uh, pieces so here you can set the reference uh, unit and let me set it so once everything is uh, set over here you can see the created um units and packaging okay now let's move on to the products and here we have to consider a product let me create a new product. Let's say that I'm going to create a product called bottle. Let me set it as favorite. And here you can see that we just need to change the unit. So let me change the unit into pieces. So here I would like to set it as piece. So as I just set it as piece here, you can see that it's been changed. And let's set the unit price as uh, that's the price uh, for sales as 2 and uh, cost as 1. So once it's been set over here, the next step is that you can just move on to the sales module. And here we can find the packaging. So this uh, adds the additional packages for this product which can be used for sales. So here you can see that we have uh, all the packages that we have created. So once you create the units of measurement, you can see that the package has also been adding over here. So here you can see that the packages which are available. So I'm going to add the carton. So here you can see that um, uh, the quantities are showing over there. So if you want to uh, get the uh, units or any other things, you can see that the unit name, the quantity. And if you want to apply any particular barcode for this um, uh, carton or for this box, you can uh, set that, okay? So here you can see I'm going to add the other one as box and let me add it. So here you can see a box of 10. So if I just apply the quantity over here, I can easily identify that. Like if I just set it as box of 10, I can easily get that it, this box has 10 quantity. Okay. But if I'm not setting that, uh, if you don't know the quantity that is available in it, you can just choose that. Uh, and uh, pack. I mean, use that package, and you would be getting uh, the quantity that is available in this package. So once this is done, you can see that now we have uh, three units of measure that is applied for this product model. One is the uh, pieces, that is the uh, reference unit, and uh, here under the sales, you can see it's CTN and box. Now you can just uh, purchase the item and afterwards you can just do the sales. So let me move on to the purchase module first. So as we just move on to the pur purchase module first, here we just need to designate the vendor. You can just fill out the details of the vendor. And uh, here I'm going to consider the product which is, uh, yeah, which is bottle. So let me search for the product bottle. Upon choosing the uh, product bottle, here you can see that one quantity so it will be moving as pcs uh, which means uh, here one piece is indicated okay now let me set it as a uh, box okay so one box will have 10 quantity 
so here you can see that the untaxed amount is just turned into 10 this is because one box contains 10 quantity okay now if i'm setting it as uh, card 10 here you can see that the amount will be changing into 100 so which means the um, um, carton has 100 quantity and we have just provided um, the four piece price as one now if you want to change it as box or anything you can just set that now let me confirm it so you can see that the unit has been applied over here in previous versions we can find that we had separate uh, option for setting the package now we can find it comes under the unit itself and you can just confirm the order so once the order is confirmed you can just receive the item to receive the item choose the receive button or you can just move on to the reception and upon clicking on validate you can see that we have just added the item and here you can find the moves over here so uh, the quantity is 100 pieces and if you want to see the barcode that's been applied uh, this picking is already done so here you cannot see that and uh, uh, yeah here you can find the product uh, from which vendor we have purchased the source the status the priority and uh, let me confirm everything okay so let's back and afterwards we just need to uh, sale this item so let's move on to the sales module in the sales module let me create a new quotation and here we just need to fill out the details of the customer my all-time favorite customer is duck verdict who is a loyal customer because he would like to always purchase the item from me so that i'll be choosing the product over here which is a bottle so here you can see that uh, the unit is automatically added over here but in this case you can see that uh, um, duck verdict would like to purchase 10 pieces so here you can see that the unit price is automatically changing if you want to apply the taxes you can just apply that so we know that each box contains 10 pieces of bottle and each of the bottle per piece cost um, two dollar so as we just change the unit or the packaging over here here you can see that the unit price is uh, changing and a 10 percentage of discount is automatically applied and um, here you can see that the amount is just turned into $18 and here you can see that it has got a 15 percentage of tax and which is 2.70 upon adding 18 plus 2.70 will be getting a total of 20.70. Now we just need to confirm this so let me save the quotation and click on confirm and now we just need to deliver the item to the customer. To make the delivery you can just uh, move on and here you can see that the item is available right now upon clicking on validate you can see that we will be sending an um, sms to confirm this delivery order so let me confirm it and here you can see that we have just validated which means we have just delivered the item to the customer so that's how we just manage with the units of measurement and packaging in Udu 90 so that's all for today if you find this video informative please do like share and subscribe my channel our channel if you want Udu customization Udu implementation and Udu tutorial videos Feel free to contact Cyprosis and that's all for today. Thank you for watching the video.